All right, guys, so we are here at our first property. This is the big one that we normally do. Uh, it's 35 houses in here. Uh, yesterday, it rained a lot, uh, but it did clear up a little bit. We had a couple guys come out here and trim it all. So today, all we have to do is mow. And uh, yeah, the guys have already kind of started mowing, but as you can see, we got the uh, flatbed out. Uh, this is the first time we've had the flatbed out this year, out mowing with us. So um, I'm driving it today, just kind of make sure everything's good. And it, it made it here just fine, so I'm, I'm pretty happy about that. So, all right, let's get mowing. I think we actually might make record time today. It's barely 10 o'clock and uh, we probably got 30 minutes of mowing left. Uh, the guys on the outside with the 252s or the backs I should say, uh, they're about done. So me and Albero, we got about another 30 minutes a piece on all the fronts and we're about out of here. So we're doing really good. Today's the day we're actually going to do pretty close to 60 properties today. Um, I do think, you know, we're a little bit lucky because all of ours is, you know, in, in big groups and that makes it a hell of a lot easier. And by no means am I saying that a four man crew can do 60 properties in a day. Um, it's probably possible. Yeah, who knows? But, uh, you know, just you know, the right circumstances, you can pull it off. And for me, I'm actually kind of kicking myself because I've wasted a lot of time the last few years not doing it the way we're doing it now. We're running four mowers, uh, you know, four weeders whenever we can, um, and just knocking it out really, really fast. And, you know, saving a lot of time, but you know, it costs a little bit more as far as the business goes, because we're bringing more more mowers and more, uh, more trucks, more trailers, everything like that. But we're able to knock out a lot more properties that day and get it, I mean, we're knocking out a big chunk of our properties in one day and that's, very very helpful it's funny because we've actually dumped a lot of grass and uh the black truck probably probably would be getting pretty full right about now uh this flatbed we're gonna be able to move some grass uh the bad news is, is that it's gonna take extra long and extra hard to get all that grass out of here we're using the tarp today uh but you know we're gonna have to clean a lot of that off because it's just gonna be way too heavy to pull and you hook a machine up to it, like a mower or something, and a strap, and it's just gonna rip it probably. But we'll figure it out. We're gonna try to figure out the best way, uh, kind of play with different different ideas and different options. So um, I'm just super excited. This is kind of what I was hoping for for the year. Uh, the way the rain has kind of worked out, we really haven't been able to kind of put the plan in place, but now you can kind of see it kind of working. And 
uh, we're gonna have we're gonna have a good time this year. Alright guys, so I made it back to the shop. Uh, it's been a long day. It's about 7 o'clock in the evening. and uh, But we got a lot of stuff done. A lot of stuff. Uh, I'm trying to think of how many properties it was that we got done today. It's pretty close to 60. Alright, so I just counted them up. It's actually about 53. So not quite close to 60, but 53 in one day. Uh, that's got to be a top-notch record. I did have a lot of things going in my favor. Uh, the biggest one, we already had weed eated, so I'm not sure you can count that. But anyway, we got a lot done today. I'm really, really happy. Uh, the flatbed today did excellent. Did excellent. You know, it's a doesn't have a whole lot of get up and go, but you know, they got us from A to B, and we got a lot of grass, as you can see. Uh, that's going to be a lot of fun dumping that. So anyway, we got another full day tomorrow to close out the week. Um, not really sure how many we have tomorrow, but, uh, you know, we should be able to get it done. I think it's going to be another long day, but we should be able to get all caught up. Uh, we did miss this, uh, Wednesday. Uh, we did mow on Wednesday. That's why some of the, some of the big property was weed eated. Uh, it was too wet to mow. So I just had the guys go weed eat. Uh, that, I mean, that gives us a big head start, uh, especially on like big properties. I know you probably can't do that with singles. Um, but you know, big properties, it helps, it helps, you know, go weed eat it and then you end up spending a little bit more time cause you end up having to blow off twice. I don't like leaving the grass over there overnight on driveways and patios and things like that. So you end up blowing off twice, but it does help a little bit. So, uh, you know, we do that whenever we have to, whenever we can, and, uh, it works out pretty good. So that's about all for today. Uh, we're just kind of steadily kind of plugging along, kind of you know, working things out, trying to figure out the best way to do things. I think we made a good progress today on, on that. And uh, we've never, in my other three years, we've never been able to get that much done. And uh, there's been some times where we couldn't get half of that done in two days. So um, we are definitely making progress. Uh, a lot of things are, are, are looking up. So I'm, I'm really, really happy. And my guys, uh, you know, Jesse, Albero, uh, new guy Brett, 
uh, my part-time guy Josh those guys are working their tail off and I couldn't ask for anything more um, they are doing doing one heck of a job and I I want I want to let them know here on camera that I appreciate it um, I don't I don't tell my guys enough how how good they how good they do and how and how awesome they really are but uh, um, you know I do want them to know so anyway guys be happy be humble stay hungry I'm gonna see you guys tomorrow I'm gonna I'm definitely gonna film again tomorrow and uh, we'll have some videos coming up shortly bye